How many tats do you have? I got a lot now that I've, you know, missing members of my family. So I've, I've been kind of going a little haywire. I, I spend a little more time in the makeup chair. Bill Hollister doesn't have any tats. So well, I mean, you I know, roll my I mean, sleeves, yeah. it's, a, it's a makeup, uh, a makeup thing, which is, you know, I, I hate being in makeup, but, you know, I had so much uh, practice on True Detective, like five hours in makeup when we were old. Well, you mean, yeah. So this is not a bad thing. No. 20, 20 minutes, we can cover them all. But so I have many, probably, to answer you? your question, I don't know, maybe 50 now. Five, zero. Yeah, just my arms, really. That's it. What yeah. was the first one you got? First one I got was in Amsterdam when I was 17. I that got sounds a, like a... I got a Celtic cross on the inside of my arm that now looks more like a... Um, a faded uh, donut, but, um, <laughs> but it uh, it was cool because okay. it was at this place, Hanky Panky in Amsterdam. That's odd that a place uh, in Amsterdam would be called Hanky Panky. Yeah, and then well, you could get some ink there. Yeah, Stephen, I'm not gonna lie, that sounds he's a, he's was, a were, legendary were there, tattoo artist. Were there any red uh, lights in that district? There were some red lights in that <laughs> district when I went. <laughs> And uh, for okay. me, the Amsterdam was like the 60s back then because, you know, I wasn't here in the 60s, so it was kind of like just freedom oh, yeah. kind of. It was kind of right. cool. Do you regret any ink that you have? Uh, uh, no, I never got one for like an ex-girlfriend or I had to change okay. it to like, you know, you know, something else friends have. But I no, most of my tats are actually, they mean a lot to me and oh, they're family good. members. I got my brother there. I got my dad, my mom. On your left arm and, right uh, there. Okay. I got so many. There's a my record year then? I was born. 1973. Yeah, that's a record for my brother. My brother was a, an amazing songwriter, probably one of the biggest in Nashville, Andrew Dorff. He wrote all Blake Shelton's hits, and so songwriting kind of has followed in the in the in background the of my yeah, family. Sure. And my brother was really killing it, and which which uh, makes me more sad that he couldn't really be here through his success because sure. we're still hearing his songs on the radio every day so well congrats on your success for more of the rich eisen show tune to audience channel 239 on direct tv for free on br live or download the rich eisen show app